Putting North Dakota first. KX News at 10 starts now. Good evening. I'm Renee Cooper. Thanks for watching KX News. In our top story tonight, a debate in the capital city continues. The controversy surrounding Custer Park is continuing to draw protests from community members looking to make a change. Melanie Monez was one of the organizers of the effort to rename Custer Park. You know, commemorating Custer perpetuates hate. And our public places and shared spaces need to be inclusive and welcoming to everybody. It needs time we move forward as a community together. When she and others brought the issue to the park board commissioners in February this year, they came up with a new process for renaming parks, one that would take 15 years for a new proposal. We won't give up. Um, it's, not, it's not right. It's not right in our public places and shared spaces should be inclusive and welcoming to everybody. Today, Monez says she's trying to gain input from the community to see how to move forward in the fight to rename the park. In the meantime, though, she says she's been invited to a meeting to meet with a park board committee about the topic. I've been invited to a meeting. We haven't been invited to sit on the committee, um, but we have been invited to a meeting, so we will go forward in the next few days with having these important discussions with the park board. Monez's niece Katie Benson said she attended tonight's gathering along with roughly 20 others to show support and set an example. I take it as a personal responsibility as an older sibling to help teach my younger siblings because in many times adults tend to not do that. They're so worked up about doing their own thing that they forget to teach the younger generations about why is it, why is it bad. Benson says she'd like to see it renamed to something honoring nature. It would be uh, just a very good like inspiration to just everybody to like come together. She, like many others at the meeting, doesn't think historical significance warrants the name. My only problem with the Custer is like there's no significance for his name to be there. It, it, there is it, and to have it changed just shows that we're getting we're like having a step forward in the right direction and being on the right side of history. Reporting in Bismarck for KX News, Maddie Beer Temple. Mona says she'll be meeting with the Park Board Committee, and that's on Tuesday. Well, COVID-19 has had a major impact on people of all...